Okay, welcome back to Sparty Hawk Cash. We are going to finish opening this uh, 2016 Topps Museum Collection uh, baseball box here. We have uh, two more boxes to go through right there. And uh, we'll pull those out. And I think for luck purposes, we'll go out of order. We'll do the fourth one here. Uh, see if we get a little better luck going out of order. And uh, see what we come up with. In the uh, first two boxes that we just broke, we um, had a Greg Holland archival autograph. Um, I think it was 279 out of 299, Kansas City Royals reliever from last year. And then a Rugned Odor. Um, Meaningful materials, 31 out of 50. So those were the two hits we had in the first. Nothing too spectacular, but, uh, you know, Royals, uh, Holland is a nice. I can't remember if they kept Holland or if he's been released from the team. He might, might have been released. Um, but anyhow, and I like uh, Rugnet Odor. He, uh, he might be popular on eBay after the uh, brawl they had, the uh, Rangers with the Blue Jays and him popping Joey Batista, so we'll move this back card to the front, and we'll give it a whirl here with these uh, Topps Museum 2016 Museum Collection. So we've got Jason Kipnis to start off with here with uh, Cleveland, and this year Cleveland cards are good cards to have since uh, I'm, I'm hoping for, at this point, if the Royals are going to be eliminated, I'm hoping for a... Uh, Cleveland slash Cleveland Indians Chicago Cubs World Series. I think that would be probably one of the more exciting World Series. So, Stephen Piscotti, and um, we've got Prince Fielder. Oh, nice. We got we had Jock Peterson in the uh, in the first one there, and now we have Jock Peterson, 11, or 17 out of 199 in the green parallel. So um, that'll go nicely, complement the other one. We'll maybe put list those together on eBay. So, okay, let's see what our uh, big hit is here. Survey says, ooh, nice. An Andrew McCutcheon quad relic, primary pieces. And that's it, eight out of ninety-nine. So, all right, not too bad. That's um, that's a decent card. McCutcheon's a decent player. Got a quad relic there. Looks like it's all brown. Primary pieces. Have our daughter looking that up. Uh, P P O R A M C, and Beckett. Probably not listed, but you never know. So anyway, that's a nice nice card there. We'll take a look at that later. And, okay, let's hit up the last one here. Keep your fingers crossed for some uh, maybe Babe Ruth signature, Ted Williams signature swatch. Uh, I don't know if Ty Cobb is in this. Maybe Roberto Clemente signature swatch. Something, uh, something big, something huge. Garner a nice payday, perhaps, um, on these here. So, all right. <clears throat> Last box. Move that over. Doesn't feel anything spectacular. I don't feel a book card in here. Feels about normal width. So let's see what we can pull out. Wow, we, back card is a Andrew McCutcheon canvas collection. So that's nice. It's not an original, but it'll be a nice complement to that. Uh, primary pieces we just pulled. So there's a canvas collection. This is probably about a $5 card. CC23 on there, canvas collection. Move that over there. That, like I said, that'll go well with, um, with the uh, primary pieces we just pulled, the quad relic. And there's Zach Granke on the Diamondbacks. It's a nice card. Uh, I was always a Zach Granke fan. And... Uh, it's a nice card. I like I like Grenke. Oop, let me do this here. I'll make one minor adjustment. Okay. Here we go with uh, Deline Betances or B 
Patances. I'm not sure of his name, but that's him right there. Dellen Batances. And um, all right, not too bad. Eric Hosmer, too bad it's not a blue or a green parallel, but it's a gold. So a little bit nicer than the base parallel card. But Eric Hosmer, your 2016 uh, All-Star Game MVP. And here we go for our second autograph. Let's see what we come up with here. Wow, okay. Zach Wheeler of the New York Mets, New York Metropolitans, 161 out of 299, a dual relic signature swatch. Not quite the big hit we were looking for. Uh, we were looking for a bigger hit, but still a decent card. And uh, it would be nice to put up there on our eBay store. So again, recapping the last... Uh, Two boxes we just broke here of this 2016 museum collection. We have those two uh, Andrew McCutcheon cards, the Canvas collection, and then the uh, signature, or I'm sorry, primary pieces quad relic there. This one is 17 out of 99, I believe. I take it back, it's 8 out of 99. I can't even read. <laughs> so. So I need my readers on. So 8 out of 99. And then, uh, like I said, those will be paired together probably on eBay. We have this here, uh, the Zach Wheeler, uh, 161 out of 299, autograph signature swatch. So decent looking card for the New York Metropolitans. And then the last one is this green parallel, uh, Jock Peterson, which we have pulled his base card as well. And uh, we'll be listing that on eBay. That's a uh, that's the 17 out of 199. So, okay, uh, that was it. We're gonna probably break open. We've got another Gypsy Queen 2015 box to break, and then we have three 2016 Tops Allen and Ginter. So we still have a few more uh, cards to go through here. So we'll be back. Thanks for watching.